in this video tutorial i am going to design this cylinder head in solid work 2018 the drawings of uh, the cylinder head is given all views and we are going to design it in solid work so go to sketch and open the sketch on the top plane and i am going to add a circle and the dimension of this circle is given as 3.550 and then I'm just going to add a center line here and a center line horizontal angle between them is 45 and now I am going to add a circle from this point this will be the center of that circle and the dimension of that circle is given as 0 0.750 and I am going to mirror this circle circular mirror select this and we need a fold added this line to fully define it. Now I am going to trim it, select the trim to close it. We don't need it this this portion, this portion, this portion, this portion. Sketch fillet is given as and the radius 0.5. I am going to dimension this rectangle, the position dimensions and everything. This is given as 0.125, and this is given as from here to here, it's given as 0.125. And from this to this, this is given as 0.375. dimension is given as line and this line and when the uh, 
properties dialog box appear you can add relation from here i am going to add equal so this sketch is fully defined now and exit and click on the revolve face box so revolve will be done by by the axis of revolution this center line will be the axis of revolution like that so this is done i am going to go to isometric view and now we needed to add a revolve cut under the bottom of this cylinder head so i am going to open this sketch on front plane again and click the space bar and go to normal view <coughs> this is like that i am going to add a triangle like that so this is given as 0 0.05 and from here to this point it's also given divided by 2 and add a reference line a center line from here like that so this revolve part will be done with this axis of revolution this center line and go to revolve part. so this part will be made with the reference of this axis of revolution this center line you can also add the relation like that i did like that and this dimension is given as 0.332 and again i am going to select a circle either i i, I go on this arc and activate this center and start the uh, circle from this center or i just simply add a circle here like that I am going to add the relation I am going to select this this edge of that arc and this circle and make that the relationship between them is concentric like that but this way is like more easy and less time taking and again go here on this edge activate this center like that now i added this dimension i am going to make the relation between them equal so i am going to press control select this circle and keep pressing this control and select all these four circles and add a relation between them equal so equal relation between them is added and it's fully defined exit this sketch go to normal view and uh, extrude it cut and under the type of uh, the end condition i am going to select through uh, now the only one feature is left which is fillet i am going to select the fillet and go to the bottom revolve that you can revolve by pressing the middle mouse button and select this sorry this is wrong selection i am I just needed to select this edge and this dimension is 0.350 go to normal this this model is done we just needed to add the material i am going to 
edit material and select the cost wise to you okay okay and this is done thank you so much please subscribe my channel like my videos and share my videos with your friend please